4.5 billion years ago, some say God's face moved on the waters, and the depths were silent and still. And others say a cloud of cosmic dust condensed and settled. Coincidence, luck, chance or fate, enter the Big Bang. And in time, the seas would swell and churn, teeming with life. And from the wonder of the deeps could be seen a new world. And high above, the air was thick with the smell of temptation. And we knew then what it was to dream. Mountains rose and the sea boiled. And in the passing and fanfare, we would know what it was to sip of the air and to feel the land beneath us. The children of Pikaia, living, breathing, dancing into the fossil record. like I would if I was driving out across uh, western Kansas where you've got flat farmland as far as the eye can see, 360 degrees. As a matter of fact, the times that I've been out of the ocean, I felt like I'm in Kansas in a weird way because of this, that's the only other place that I know of where you can have 360 degrees flat horizon. As I'm hunting in the beds, you know, when I'm walking down through there, especially after a rain, it has that smell of fish in the ocean. It smells like uh, a shore. When I'm down in the beds, I feel like, you know, like walking on the ocean floor in a weird way, hoping to catch something on your way. <laughs> like our past holds as much wonder and uncertainty. Hurtling through time and space, we move forward looking back. But don't close your eyes. And it is written. We shall not cease from exploration. In the end of all our exploring will be to arrive where we started and to know that place for the first time. Planet Ocean.